the world recovery, uh, which was weak in the first place, is in danger of stalling. The epicenter of the danger is Europe, but the rest of the world is increasingly affected. There is an even greater danger, namely that the European crisis intensifies. In this case, the world could be plunged into another recession. My third guest is uh, Pedro Carlos, who's the uh, head of Carlson. And he talks about the key issues and how fiscal consolidation will proceed. Fiscal consolidation must proceed, but at an appropriate pace. Decreasing debt is a marathon, not a sprint. Going too fast will kill growth and further derail the recovery. It is useful to remember that it took more than two decades to successfully decrease debt from its World War II levels. Our forecast, you may ask, what are our forecasts based on? They are based on the assumption that the measures that I've talked about will be adopted and that the euro crisis will slowly decrease in intensity. If these measures are not adopted, then one can fear the worst. If they are adopted decisively, then the world economy may actually perform better than our forecasts. One should be under no illusion, however, the brakes will still be on and unemployment will decrease slowly at best. We have a long way to go before the world economy has fully recovered. So the euro area crisis still needs to be addressed. Who should bank up the money? Sharing budget.